So, one of the most important things that you need to do when training an AI on your own character is to pick a base model that is most close to the target style you want. Stable Diffusion's default style leans more towards photorealism. But if you want something else, you can follow the link in the description and you can go to Civit AI under models and just look around until you find the one that looks most similar to the art that you want to create. The only thing that I would recommend you do is to avoid using models that say XL. If this is your first time training, and especially if you don't have an amazing computer, I recommend and just avoiding XL for now. Personally, I'm going for more of an anime style here, so I'm gonna pick this one. And once you've picked your style, you can click this arrow right here and start downloading it. Wait a few minutes and once it's done, go to where you installed Stable Diffusion, Web UI, Models, Stable Diffusion, paste it in, and now just run Stable Diffusion the way you normally would. Once you see this scene, go to the top left, select the new base model that you just downloaded, you're done. Congratulations. Now your local version of Stable Diffusion is focused on your new target style. From here, the next step is to capture the training data for your new character, which I'll show you how to do in the next video. In the meanwhile, hope that helps, and as always, I hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.